What's going on, y'all? It's your boy G1GB Nodger back here with another video, and this is G1GB TV. You know, down in the comment section, how you feeling? How your day been going? How your week going? How was your weekend? Let me know. Let's 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 chat it up. You can also check out my three new episodes that I dropped of me reacting to social media comments about my Hellcat. It get crazy, not gonna lie. But in today's video, we're gonna be reacting to a video of me getting my Hellcat. So technically it was already wrapped, but it was me adding my finishing touches to the whole thing to bring it together. Most of all the details you're gonna see, I'm gonna point them out in the video and let you know what, what everything means so everybody's on hip though. Everything on my Hellcat. Let's go ahead and get straight into it. Got the video pulled up and ready to go, man. Good YouTube, it's shit YG1 GB now. The back here with another video. Hey look man, I'm smiling, don't work something. Bro, me with hair is wild, bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> bro, me with hair, man. Uh uh, I can't do that no more. Super excited to show y'all this masterpiece that we're about to put together. So we here. We're at Bear Knuckles. Bear Knuckles Automotive, and my car has been wrapped. If you've seen it from the title and the thumbnail. So I'm excited, bro. I'm lost for words, bro. Hey, if this is your first time seeing me on the screen. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Wait, you done right? Too excited, I forgot what I said. Bro, at this moment, like, I was, like, dumb happy. Like, I couldn't even talk. That's just how excited I was, bro. Like, I was just lost for words, man. Oh, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let me, let me, get, my, let me get my thoughts together. We're going to keep this in the video, too. Nah, right, let me see. Let me get my thoughts. Oh. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just show him the car, bro. Oh, first of all, we gotta get him right here. This is like, my boy's been up here counting. Hey, so now I gotta give a big shout out to my boy Austin. This man worked his ass off to make sure my car was exactly how I wanted it. I'm talking about early mornings and long nights, man. So, big shout out to Austin and Bare Knuckles. I was putting in massive work to make sure this car is exactly how I want it from every single small detail. Now look, y'all, here, here it goes. Wait, 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 wait. wait. There we go, bro. Now, if you watched any of my previous videos of the reacting to crazy social media comments, the main thing that people would say was my car look like a cow. Not gonna lie, I see it. <laughs> I definitely see it, especially like before we airbrushed it. This bitch was screaming Chick Fil A cow, bro. Now I know what y'all thinking. It looked like a, it looked like Chick Fil A on it. it looked like a cow. Well, we we gonna we gonna fix that here, my boy right here as well, right here. Yeah. Air brush art. Shout out to my boy Rob, man. He he go crazy, bro. This is a definitely a dope artist, bro. If it wouldn't been for him, I don't think my car looking the way it looked like after the rap would have been possible, man. Like he helped me out so much. Big shout out to him again. Y'all make sure y'all go follow all his social media. Mainly, well, just, just Instagram and Shades of Color. Y'all make sure y'all do that, man. Dope parties. We're going to put some artwork together and we're going to get this show on the road. But I do want to show y'all this whole wrap before we do the thug chisel and make it look how it's supposed to look. My favorite part of this car, y'all catch the Hellcat logo. Exhibit A. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure if you don't know, I'm gonna put you on game. I go by G1GB Nigel, you know, obviously. And I decided I wanted to create something one of one and put my name in my Hellcat sign. And this is basically what you're looking at. One of my favorite parts of the car, well, favorite parts of the rap. And like, bro, this Hellcat sign alone took at least two months. Just for the Hellcat sign, bro. Cause I wanted like, Trying to figure out the way I want to do it without making it looking, without making it look like so like off the wall was the tough part. But like once I got it figured out and I kind of had the direction, I was straight. I was good to go. So I don't think y'all catch. I'm gonna give y'all five seconds to really look at this Hellcat logo and see if y'all really catch the detail. Y'all got it? One, two, three. Okay, you know what? You know, G one, G B. Well, I think you need to step back and see that. Hold on. Hard. I think, I think you need to step back and see that detail up there. Hard. I 
Oh my god. Oh my god, that's, uh, that's an amazing hell okay, look, that's, that's one of one shit right there. That's one of one. Okay. That thing is awesome. So, basically right here is, so basically right here, this is me showing my logo under the wrap. And basically with this detail, I wanted to really show that I went through some rough days around this time last year, you know, losing my Dukes and everything. And I wanted to put my logo under the wrap so you could feel like the texture of it, you know, basically symb symbolizing, you know, the rough days, like I was just saying. And, you know, just a cool, smooth way to show that detail off, bro. I like the embroidery. Embroidery right, right here, man. Oh, man, this, this shit gets better, bro. We come on this side now. We got the reverse. We go reverse with the black side, you know. Reverse, you know what I'm saying? You still see the words. It's a little backwards, but you know. You feel me? I'm just too excited right now. Got my own SRT logo up there as well, man. You know. And of course, my favorite part of the car. I know y'all have already seen it, but you know, I can't, I can't not record and not show y'all this masterpiece. Shout out to my dudes. Man. That might got one truly. Mr. Shades of color right here behind you. My dukes, bro. Right there, man. Yeah. Did the That's best thing on the car. Fuck the, car. Car. the rap. This is still the best thing on the car. Now, one last thing to show y'all before we get to show on the road. We ain't done. We ain't done. We go door jams. We go door jams, by the way. Hard. Now, what I want to really, you know, um, show off with this detail is my logo is represented by God and it's peace, you know, all the, the, you know, bells and whistles of everything. But I wanted to make it seem like, well, I didn't want to make it seem, I made it seem as if you, you can't see it until you open my door and it's like having God tucked away with you. So he's always with you at all times. You, you, you feel like it's small hidden details and a lot of things in my rap are small and hidden that you don't know until you really got to pay attention to detail to see. We don't skip no details. Door jams, by the way. Door jammies, by the way. It's on every door. Door jammies, by, by the way. Wow. That's cool that I like that. <sighs> Man, so I think I did some one-on-one -on -one shit. Oh yeah, I got to show y'all this too. One last thing. I know I just said one thing a second ago, but uh. This is how you bring your vision to life. Do you understand me? Bro, this is all looking at the straight vision like and starts on papers. Like no cap. Legitimately. A lot of trial and error. A lot of mistakes. Saying? Now I got my words together. If this but is your first time seeing on the screen, please make sure you hit that sub button, drop That's a like, awesome. and drop a comment. Let's go. Alright, so y'all see this, right? Y'all just make sure y'all remember that, like later on down the line, like I don't know if y'all can kind of see what, like, what I was really going for, but I was going for like a bait kind of thing with my logo. I kind of like how it was coming out, and I kind of it's, it's some stuff I don't that I gotta tweak. But I'm gonna get it right, and you know y'all are definitely gonna see this in the future. So hey, y'all keep that on y'all membranes, bro. The good starting point range. We can work our way that way, or we can work. I remember, we were sitting there chilling. Smoking a blunt, and um, I told him. Boy, I hate taping, boy. What's so popping? It is. I hate it though. It's like crap in a pocket. Right, but I still hate doing it. That's fair. For sure. For sure. Ain't nobody gonna be looking for it. Hey, it's more. Yeah. Man, I really honestly want to just start painting, but I really want to take shit. I need to airbrush it on there with the airbrush down there. Probably, you know, it's just a little bit more. You got it, you got it. Yeah, I was thinking about that, but that shit didn't. You got it. You're not going to take over the world. Nothing that I will say, though, like, bro, we should 
Yeah, you're holding your weeks after. Yeah, I didn't even start spicy curry chicken. Anything. But for me, I mean, all they had was cabbage and black and uh, cabbage. Bro, I see the words. Yeah, they didn't even but being a big ain't easy, bro, because you gotta learn. Oh, damn. The headbutt? The headbutt? Oh, what you talking about? I don't know what I was eating, what I was chewing on, but goddamn, bro. The ASMR. <laughs> the kind of with the metallic, they kind of give it that little. All right, so you know I gotta touch on this as well. Like I told you, I didn't want to skip anything that was that you could see aesthetic wise. So I wanted to make my name. I didn't want to just put my name like any everybody else does. I wanted to put my name and make it look like I had the Brembo logo. And me and him actually customly made my name with a font that was similar to the Brembo font, and then we put the slashes through it, like. I ain't gonna count. Like it's the small things that matter. I could have swore. Oh, there it is. Wait. sitting here painting the front end bro like I am super nervous because for one this is my first time painting a car two we the, the design I'm doing is kind of like freehandly just going with the flow like you're really basically winging it so I'm like man I don't know how this shit gonna turn out and then also I saw that shit bro he, he tried something with like a plastic bag to get like the texture Bruh, hell no. Nah. Like, that shit was not it. I seen that. I'm like, hey, dog, we got to fix this right here, Brody. Like, <laughs> that ain't it. <laughs> so, like, this is the time I was like, like, I don't know about this shit, bro. But we was already had started to take the car up, man. It was just like, man, fuck it. You got to figure it out, man. This is one of these things, like, you really just had to, like, trust the process. Literally. I was there, like, I was there. I can never go back to the bottom. Yes, sir. She's starting to see my vision come to life, man. It's feeling like a dream of seeing something you draw on paper. be sitting in front of you, man. It's like really like painting my own dream right here, man. You feel me? She want it too. I figured I only had about two months anyway, you know, you feel me? 
I'm tired of shit, dude. I feel like I only had about two more in the first place. I knew it was about time to get tired anyway, man. I gotta stop burning up. I lied. Hold on. That big old baby <laughs> ass. <laughs> yeah, right. This is the worst time. That bitch like a baby's ass back there, bro. For my skin bones, bro. That ain't ball. Hey, whoa! I've seen worse in the Mopar community. Damn, really? Mine's nowhere near now. Damn. But you know it's hard to tell if you look at your car every day. You just see the outside. Ah, these. That's why I right in this area. I'll check this out. Working hard. We're getting work done. Doesn't look the same now, does it? So we're basically pulling off the effect of, yeah, this bitch burnt up. Now it's old looking. I Man, really just, I don't know how to really explain to y'all what the hell I'm looking at. So basically, let me go ahead and put y'all on game. So the whole rap is, you know, around the time last year, you know, when I lost my Dukes, I, I went through hell, lost myself, you know, a lot of personal stuff and life and mental was just not all the way right man so i went through hell so i wanted my car to represent me around this time and saying like i was beat up tore up scratched up but you know i'm still moving i'm still i'm still here i'm still trying to figure it out bro as, as time goes on man and you know I, for me to put my story into a rap bro is not a lot of people are doing that bro so I, I like being different, man, one-on-one. -on -one. It's kind of hard for me to look at, like, as far as me explaining what the hell going on. But I will tell y'all this, though. This bitch hard, though. This bitch hard, you feel me? Oh, Real shit, though, so, like, we, we want to make it look like the car scratched up, burned up, went through pure hell, literally hell, and this is what we come out to be. So if my car was burned up or somebody light a match to it, this is exactly what you tend to see. Pretty different. Not something you see on a day to day basis. I haven't seen it on a Hellcat. Have you seen it on a Hellcat? If you have, tag the nigga name Let me in know. the comment because I want to see his Hellcat. Let me I know. think I got the one on one rap. You know, you feel me? Comment. Yeah, how are we finish this bitch, below. man? We got probably like, what, five, six hours? We'll get faster. You're right, it is going to get faster. This is probably the most detailed part is the front because the front is where the engine is. That's probably where the most electronical or flammable parts would be at. So we get past this, we're gonna start flying. Y'all enjoy the montage of us continuing to work on the route. So working very diligently, man. That been coming together, gang. All the small details, bro. You know, it's wild looking back at this shit now, bro. It's super wild, bro. It's a lot of time to talk about it. Super thin. I'm tired, bro. Shit, not funny as you thought, is it? Bro, at this moment right here, this is when, like, Boy, I've been painting. We've been here since like 9 a.m. I think right around this time, like four. Bro, so 10, 11, 12, one, two, three, four, that's seven hours. I've just been on my feet painting, bro. Bro, I was tired as shit. I'm, I'm telling you like, that shit was on my ass, bro. And I ain't been here no with all day. Yeah, like right four, four, well, feet a long goddamn time, bro. And we still not done, bro. My feet barking. 
tired, bro. I'm a tired boss, bro. It be hard, though. <laughs> Still feel lazy, bro. I feel like I'm like... Yeah, it's that fast food. So you, 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 you just eating vegetables like old dude. You're right. If I was vegan, I would have been better. But you might be right on that one. You're still working. Just a little bit. Tired, bit. But it looks hella good, though, so far, though. Tired, though, bro. camera man you know so uh if y'all still watch this video make sure y'all hit the sub button y'all drop a like and drop a comment because well, we got to finish hellcat behind you and go ahead and show these folks man we got we got the finished product right here we got the finished product right here we got the finished product right here this is what everything is supposed to come out to be bro we got the finished product hellcat looks like it's been through hell Y'all just don't understand, bro. Y'all just don't understand, man. You see your yeah, masterpiece here in front of you, bro? And to be a part of doing it? Oh, yeah. So, right here, this is another detail. Now, this says Mama's Keeper. It's like a signature. And I hit it, like, in the beginning. And I ended up, like, it's painted in now. Uh, and I, I should have painted it in in the first place, but I felt like it was taken away from the actual wrap. But this is on the left hand side of my car because I am left handed. And you know, this is how, like, to the T of the details that I was about when I did everything, bro. Like, I ain't skipped no, like, I want everything about my car to be no, something nobody's ever seen before. Y'all know, it's your mama's key. I said not put that on there. Y'all come over, bro. This is probably the more chill check, man. There's nothing else I need to say, bro. This is probably one of the hardest chill checks you've seen. I know. Thank you. I appreciate it. Come on, man. The hardest hell check. The hardest hell check. I got my logos on. I know y'all didn't see it last time, but I actually hand painted my logos. I'm gonna do the drop fade to match with the wrap. You know, on both sides to match the flames. Why not, man? Why not? Why not, man? Why not, man? Come on, man. Hey, on, well, watch this. Come on, ain't it? Watch this video, like, really makes me want to drop my car. Ooh, not too hard, though. Like, not too hard. And if you're wondering, really the like car this. is coated twice. We got satin clear over the top, and we also got ceramic coat. So. No, so it's not going to come off. It, it ain't going nowhere, I promise. Oh, what, that, can they see my brakes? I know you showed a little bit, man, but we go Brembo. 
with my name on here, by the way. Grimbo with my name there, by the way. Oh, and also, my rims are also ceramic coated. I know how bad Hellcat rims get stupid dirty. That would be. Oh my God, bro. Let me tell y'all, like, <sighs> bro. A lot of time I used to, I like to this day I still hate washing my car just because it takes damn near an hour to really get the rims as clean as they're supposed to be, and like that's no cap, bro. That SRT brake dust, it's no joke. No more. I lied. Damn. I can't stop looking at that hole, bro. Right oh, I said I want to go crawl on this. Yeah, yeah, but I know my mom always here to see this. Well, she is watching it from up there. She was here to see this. And she would definitely be staring like, at the car just how I, I would, man. Hey, see mom, you're, you're still with me. I gotta let you know that. She you're still with me. Y'all, I'm not gonna cry. My mom was a real good oh. fan. I'm like, oh, I shit. Like really paint. Shit be on my ass every day, bro. You know, my mom really ain't here anymore, and the fact that you know that she can't really see in the real time of what's really going on, and it really just kind of be me, you know. And that shit hit different. You know, everybody's got to go through it, but it's the timing with me. It just wasn't, you know. God had a different plan, but you know, it's all good. Hope y'all guys really have enjoyed this video. More videos are on the way, man. All my Patreon family. Love every single last one of y'all. And until next time, y'all stay safe out here. Bless up.